fairly cramped space to make a video, but I'm down in my basement. This is my uh, main water line. And uh, it hasn't frozen in a few years because I've been keeping the house a little bit hotter, but there's sometimes a draft in this area, and I was thinking it would be good to put this a uh, heated tape on here. Um, uh, I've used a bunch of different kinds of heated tape in the past uh, to various degrees of success, um, and this one looks very straightforward. Uh, note that it is a, a round kind of uh, uh, round kind of cable that's different than some of these tapes that are really flat. I also got the really long one, uh, thinking that I could do my main, uh, start at the bottom, and then just work it down this main water feed. Um, you know, just thinking more is better. Um, I'll just kind of show you how this wraps up. I won't do the full installation, but I'll just kind of show you how it wraps. And uh, what you're going to need to do, obviously, is get a good wrap on your pipe. And um, uh, that's going to take a little bit of time, because you know, depending on the length of your pipe, but. Take a little bit of time to get a good wrap. And I think I'm gonna be able to just tighten this guy up on top here, um, just like that. But uh, you probably want some electrical tape uh, on here, or you know, you could probably use duct tape. I'm gonna use electrical tape just to secure the end as you get your wrap. Obviously, you need the wrap to be tight on the pipe because the whole point is heating up that pipe. You don't want it really loose. All right, so I've got it plugged in, and obviously this is an electrical line, so you don't want it in the water or anything like that. The plug, you can't really see that because of my sump pump line, but the plug, uh, it's the orange one, and it does glow when it's plugged in, so that's cool. You can tell if this guy's actually getting juice or not via that plug, so if you lose a circuit or something, uh, you'll know that, that guy's out. And uh, just uh, final thoughts on this tape. Uh, the only downside I think about it is that it's not flat. That flat tape gets a really nice wrap around the, the pipe, but instead it's kind of electric cord shaped. But I still think if you, you know, finesse it and tighten it up on your pipe, as you can see here, just kind of flatten it up, I think you'll get a pretty good connection. And uh, yeah, it's got some good heat to it.